Good morning, all. I just wanted to just to do a follow up piece on an article I shared with you last night. Uh, this one in regards to why Brexit is destroying your pension uh, and how you could use it to to start conversations with potential customers or even existing ones, and also as part of your uh, lead generation campaigns too. What you'll find is that there's lots of this sort of content in the news, uh, which is really valuable actually, normally from industry experts too. I think I just want to give you some ideas on how you can leverage it <coughs> uh, for your own campaigns as well. Now, the first thing I recommend you do is, is review the article or the content and write your own version of it or write your, not your own version of it as such, but uh, write a follow-up piece which gives your thoughts and opinion on this based on your experience. So we all know there's lots of uncertainty with Brexit. There's lots of noise. <coughs> People don't really know what's going on. So you could actually use that as a hook, if you like, to, to get people to read up your article and give you a chance to showcase what you think. You could then use that as a call to action to say, well, would you like a free pension review or would you like to, <clears throat> to, to speak to us about it? And you could add that as a blog post on your website and send traffic to it with a, the call to action or even just within a post on your Facebook page and then use that within Facebook accounts as well. You can obviously connect that to a lead form too. I think, uh, excuse me, another thing you can also do is do a video on it, exactly exactly how I'm doing now, where you could just review the article and give your thoughts and opinions as you, uh, as you walk through it. If you do videos, you can actually then record or retarget people that watched, say, 75% of it, and, you know, these people are, are quite engaged as well. One thing with this sort of types of content is that there, there's also some useful sort of subheadings like pension scams, midlife MITs, uh, pension dashboards. So these are things you could use to uh, use for your own lead generation campaigns as well as hooks and other ways in. Now, obviously, the finally, The Independent is a fairly big publication. And I think this is actually a great way to associate yourselves with something they've written. Uh, or a journalist that's written and just try and get you to link it with, with your campaigns. Just a quick video this morning, let me know what your thoughts are. Uh, if you have any questions on, on how to do this or even how to set up this from a technical point of view, uh, just leave a comment and I'll get back to you.